Hey guys, welcome back. This is Mana and today I feel like poop. So we're just gonna work on something that I've been wanting to do forever and ever and ever. And it's kind of like a nice sit down comfy cozy thing. I wanna make a save file for my apocalypse challenge. Yeah, I'm making an apocalypse challenge. I've been playing through it, trying to work out all the bugs and all the things. So I've got to the point where I really want to make the world a little more rundown and a little more grungy and a lot, a lot more fun. So let's get started and I'll tell you a little more about it while we work. It won't be to, like we won't finish this thing entirely. It, it will be a thing we do slowly over over a while. So it won't be that long of a video, I promise. Let's jump into this and work away at it and I'll let you in on a few little tidbits I got going on. Okay, so this is my plot that I'm using for my Gen 1 Sims. Um, there's lots of different things about it. You have, I have a build restriction. I have like, it's just massively restrictive. They can't leave their home lot right now. Eventually we will fill up this entire map here, but we will also be able to go around and do all of these as well. So what's happened in, to, to create the apocalypse was a virus or something has come along or, a, or too many Sims were looking at their telescopes and too many comets came, meteorites came down and killed a bunch of people. I am not sure. <laughs> Things went sideways. So we are going to trash this neighborhood. We're going to pick away at it. Um, I will probably do a lot of this stuff on my own behind the scenes because this is absolutely crazy. I've already made this crick in the neck cabana. It's all messed up. Um, I'm going to be keeping the bones of the buildings, just really running them down. Now the townies, I am not deleting the townies. I'm not getting rid of them. Like Spencer Kim Lewis family, I will be just turning them into occults. Most of the occults that I will be using because of the viruses washed through um, will be vampires because in one of my last generations, they will need to go around and cure all of the vampires. So that's part of the thing. So the vampires are the bad guys. They're the mob of the world and they run everything. They can withstand, I don't know, the nuclear fallout from things blowing up. I, if you think of apocalypse and it's like your kind of apocalypse, there's robots everywhere. I should just make a whole bunch of servos maybe. So we will start. I'm, I'm, I don't think I'm going to touch the goth house. The goth house is pretty perfect. And I'm kind of hoping that it's my like um, my vampire nexus den. I may change like their lot traits and things like that. But yeah, any empty places we will fill. So randomly, let's get started on the Bell residents. And there are four million weird looking cats. Okay. So it's cute, it's pink. Oh, oh no, it's gonna get trashed. Okay, let's look for some grungy. Um, I wish shabby. Do we got shabby? Perfect. Okay, let's do shabby in all. Okay, so. Okay, come on. There we go. <laughs> um, I'm just keeping the bones of the buildings just simply because I can't. I'm not the greatest of the builders, so it's it's not the greatest thing for me. Okay, what's what is this foundation? Nothing. I can't clone it. Okay, it must be this one. So uh, well, I guess we could. Uh, 
that we'll leave the foundation the color it is but the windows windows suck I, I want shabby <laughs> Uh, there's nothing. I just want a hole in the wall. Why don't we use island dish? I would love for just, you know, just hole in the wall stuff. I'm thinking that somebody boarded up the house. I know this is still nice. It's nice, but I'm hoping. Is that, that's a little bit dingier. Let's try that everywhere I see. One of those windows we will place One of these, I, I'm wanting to not use CC just in case somebody wants to actually play this game as play this challenge too, that everybody will be able to play it. That's why I got to work through the bugs. So, oh, of course, the chairs, you know what? Chairs go away. I don't know how to use tool, so I don't use tool. Right, the couch. And I'm not using, don't have move objects on right now. My keyboard is being finicky. I, I'm just, just having some problems with the stupid thing. Decided not to work the other day. That was great. It's a little more our style. Let's see. How's that? Or maybe some of these? I want a shabbier one. How's that? That will work. I mean, I like, I like the industrial stuff, but not everything is industrial. I wish these came in like paint chip swatches and things. I wish like literally everything came in like grungy, grungy, grungy. But we're getting rid of that. And then the for rent has the best best chairs on the planet okay i gotta actually holy cow it actually oh it i can't intersect okay i wish we'll do that Now, exterior, things are gonna be dead. Like in this save, the world is pretty much dead. So the terrain paint needs to be like too hot to trot is probably. Everything is burnt to a crisp. Don't ask me why the other, the outside the, the perimeter here is green as green can be, but this is all dead and dry. We don't know. It, it's just not a thing we think about because <laughs> we would go stir crazy. Now the plants, trees like this, this is perfect. Um, let's see, what else? Mm. 
Those trees grew up over the last few years. We, we want to get it. Okay, now I need to add some cheats. BB.show hidden objects. BB.show live edit objects. Perfect. Now we can, I normally have organized debug, but much better. Okay, so we're looking for the dead stuff. So you can actually look up like vampires and then search and all like the dead stuff will be here. So we want to keep like with the same flair, like with my gnome, I got, I'm going to set him off to the side just so I don't forget that he is here. Okay. I like that. Let's see. Okay. So we're going to just make that guy a little smaller, right? Like. Oh yeah, okay, we could do that. These ones were up here. There. Our plants are dead as doornails. Okay. Put that there. What's this? Oh yeah. I've got move objects on. Like what? Why? Okay. One more bush. Okay, is it not on? Well, okay, obviously I had a brain fart. Okay, this bush has grown wildly out of control and let's throw some of those around. Maybe the ferns decided they wanted to take over. Whoa. Nope. That guy does not work. Um, let's see. That's fine. A little bit. Okay. We're going to sell that guy. And yeah, we're, oh, <laughs> plasma fruit tree, right, right, okay, I should have, that's huge. That we don't want, it's too alive and too happy. What's this? Oh, we don't want that. We like the dead things. We like dead. Okay. We'll all... Perfect. And we want that to come off the eve. Perfecto. I wish we had some a better angle here so I could see the side. Ugh. I missed windows. We'll have to fix the inner windows. Well, the windows on from the inside anyway. Um, and so for rent, where's the little version? Oh, right. I got a match. Okay. 
Perfect. Don't want for rent. I want vampires, please. And then hit that search again. Want the walls, guys. Where's the wall stuff? And then we need one of those bushes and we're gonna not there sweetheart let's move down please perfect okay <laughs> like finagling here it's it's a little little tricky with it being so small okay that's not too bad now i hate this brick this brick sucks so we're gonna have to erase it Oh, oh, those jerks, they really, mm. well, that's poop. Okay, we're gonna have to delete it. Delete. Okay. <laughs> now, what looks like poop? What looks like poopity poop? Okay, that kind of looks like it's been here a while, but the grass in between is like really green. Like, it looks too healthy. It looks too nice. So let's maybe, it's seen some stuff. So it's, it's been smashed. mashed okay and then don't worry I'll put like dirt mud everywhere muddy mud I don't mind the pine death dart horse wallow yeah mm, that's the old trail let's smarter starter soil and we'll and we'll do that too. Don't want that nice at all. Oops. And this sucker will be pretty dead. I need to get like a mod or something that'll just turn it nighttime like nuclear fallout and it we're in like an atomic winter maybe so it's always nighttime so the vampires can always come out if you haven't watched the tv show van helsing that's kind of how i like it like something happened in that world where it went eternally dark. The clouds went over and then all the vampires that were oppressed and, you know, in hiding decided, okay, we'll come out now and it is our time. So they did and, oh boy, there was hell to pay. Now I need a garbage can. And I really like the eco lifestyle one I wanted to limit my packs but where's my where's my garbage can guy garbage thank you okay trashy right in the front like they were trying to clean it up or something now let's clean up this or distress this roof this roof has seen better days i like this one but these are kind of fun too they have holes in the roof so like the the light shows through 
And then this one, it has like skylight kind of stuff. But I don't think I like that one overly too much. We're going to... It's kind of greenish, so maybe it'll patina out to like that gray. How's that? That looks mossy and distressed. Okay, let's move inside. Oh no, all the like electronics have got to go because there is no power. Who wants these? Everybody's come through and just trashed the place. So nothing nice is left. Like they got to... It's all just gone. It's just gone because they had to make clothes. <laughs> I should use the curtains for indication where the stuff was at one time. Okay. And then the lights, they're just ripped out of the walls. Okay, so they, they don't have fresh fruit anymore. There's nothing like that. And... Oh no, that doesn't work anymore? Oh, I hate when that happens. Okay, and this is... The window for the kitchen light. Okay, now... We need to distress this floor. We want... All of it. So there's wood here, so we're gonna get really crappy wood. Wood floors. Um, not that one. Just not a fan of that. It's a bit too shiny. Okay. This actually looks really nice. So the floorboards and <laughs> we now see the screw holes in the floorboards. Okay, a uh, tile. We got got smashed up tile. Yes, we do. Okay, smashed up. That is beautiful. Oh man, I wish we had smashed up countertops, but we don't, do we? Yeah, we'll leave the counters just cause. Maybe we'll change up. Uh, actually, you know what? Why don't we just delete these? I'm sure we could find like grungier ones in the catalog here. This one, that. <laughs> yes, they're crappy. And then that's been thrown out. That's been thrown out. This rug is non-existent. Um, I want to say not too many of these things are left because it is the apocalypse and people are taking stuff. So we need a new couch. Like, What's a nice grungy looking couch? Let's see. I will probably use werewolves. Um, I, I probably will. Um, or where's that palette one? Okay, this one, Grandma's Couch is nice. Grandma's Couch is a runner up here. Grandma's Couch here. We like Grandma. Oh, darn. Oh, this one. Oh, that one is perfect. I love this couch. Now, we're going to give it like a nice brown. These are like, it looks like they were old sheets turned into a couch. And someone's grandpa made a couch. 
And we're just gonna put that up against the wall, like... Okay, do we have a coffee table that doesn't look nice? That, that is perfect. Okay, and we'll, we'll let them have their stuff. Although, these candles, I don't think... I'm going to be turning the grid off for a lot of these places. So, it's probably nice if I turn off or uh, give them some candles or something. Might as well get rid of the light. We're going to rip that right out of the wall here. So let's give them light. What are they going to use? No, no CC as much as I would love to have the CC. This is an oil sense lamp. That'll work. And then I'll just put that over there for a moment so I can shove it in the corner. So then at least they can, you know, see. Yeah. And we'll take that, put that there. Oh, that's like right in front. <laughs> The door. Okay, we'll just that. How is that? Is crooked because yeah. <laughs> I hate this door. Okay, maybe we should get a different door. Turn the lights back on. Okay, <laughs> what is it? Oh, that's a nice grungy door. I love the werewolves pack. It is absolutely grungy. My door. There, it's not the greatest thing on the planet, but this area is nice. Let's see about some decoration. So we ripped out some lights, so we can rip out those. Let's see, put that there, and then rip out that light. I think I had a ripped out light here, and a ripped out light there. And the mildew is setting in. Mildew is definitely setting in. Okay, this fridge has got to go and we got to replace it with this grungy one. This oven's got to go and we will replace it with this one. Can't have nice things in this house. This, I don't even know what it's for. Those are hung too high in my opinion. Okay. And then uh, I think a little off the grid. Yeah, okay, the yum used is uh, off the grid compatible. Let's see. Oh, this sucker is not off the grid compatible. So maybe we'll have to sell that and uh, give them a cooler instead. <laughs> They won't like it, but that's fine. They don't care. And then, of course, we need a dirty drum out front so they can cook. Have some dumpster fires. And they have the water, so they should be able to go get water. I won't be too cruel and I'll also 
give them a lunch kit. <laughs> it's it, it feeds people pretty well. Okay, mom and dad's bed is gone. Lights are gone. Wow, we have like so many different types of lights in this place. Okay, mom and dad's bed. Let's trade it out for something a little more shabby chic. Okay, a dirty double. Oh, how come I've never seen these before? These are beautiful. I love that. That's perfect. Okay, now we got singles. Do we got dirty singles? <laughs> Do we got dirty singles in our area? Oh my God. Uh, fabricated single bed. Okay, we got some, let's see. Oh, they're fancy. They're fancy in this house. No way, can't have that. Oh. No, they don't have clothes either. Okay, shrunk that so it wasn't eating the house. Um, let's see. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we'll do that. And then there, like, there was like how many people in this house? Like too many, like way too many and cats. So I'll put this there. It's a library. And then that there. Oh, you know what? No one has decorations in the apocalypse. <laughs> and then that can be here. And I don't remember how many people live in this house. So I'll just put three beds in here. And it will be fine. Okay, we need off the grid things. And I want the grossest, grungiest walls ever. So we got to go down to basement treasures. It is my all time favorite grunge pack and it's pink in here. Oh, wait a minute. <gasps> did city living get, oh, they did. Oh, <gasps> beautiful. Okay. So we need those. We need that. I wish it came like with white in the bottom. Now my tiles again. Beautiful, beautiful freaking tiles. But I want to see if if our basement treasures. I can't remember. Did not come with floors. Okay. Forgot. City living and the broken tiles will save the day. Okay, now we need off the grid water. Okay, city living did not come with anything. Now I like this tub. I like this tub a lot. Because it's cheap. Mm, I love this one too. Maybe I'll do that one, but it. Yeah, like it's totally grunged, but I need a light. I need a light. Do we got roof light? Uh, kind of.
Okay, we'll just do that for now. There is a few grungy-ish sinks here. But maybe, just maybe. Maybe we'll do that. It just looks a little more industrial, maybe. We'll do that. But I do need the mirror. And we're gonna put the broken glass mirror there. They were doing something for sure. And smash. And now the toilet of toilets. It's an outhouse in the house. That is a good question. Do we want that? Or is that too nice? Like, I was thinking like that one. Hmm. Maybe with the gross factor. I, I, I'm, I'm sorry. I do think that the squatty potties are kind of yicky. And especially this swatch. So maybe... Oh, wait a minute. Oh. I better see if these toilets... Uh-huh. Oh, no. I don't think this sink... This sink doesn't work. That one doesn't work for this. And then these toilets... Off the grid. This one works. That one is that's disgusting. <laughs> I'm caring a little bit too much for just regular random townies. Okay, that actually looks like it fits. Yeah, it's disgusting. Yeah, that, that'll work. It's gross. It's gross. Okay. Now, I need more debug. And this time, though, we're going to do vampires and also werewolves because they both have the good smashed walls kind of stuff. Oh, I maybe should have done werewolf second because there's a little more debug for werewolves. Oh, I was like, what is that? Yeah. Okay, here we go. Smash. Oh. Ooh, that's a wall crack. Or that's a floor crack. Oh, yeah, that's a floor crack. We'll do that one. Smash, crash. And let's see. Papers ripping off the walls here. Yeah. Let's do that. And for curtains, make them a little smaller. We'll just do those. Okay, I think that's good. Uh, walls, papers. We'll do some fancier stuff. I just, I don't really know if I want this to be a werewolf family.
but well, maybe I do. We'll do that. Let's see. Oh, I was going to put a gnome back. We'll give them a werewolf gnome. I was going to do the dead gnome or the grim gnome, but maybe this one is werewolves. This house is werewolves. All right. We'll work on the family maybe on the next time. So this is our new Rindle Rose. It's all dingy and yucky. It's not perfect, but I mean, at least it looks the part. So I'm going to leave this one here. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you can follow along on this save file journey. So until next time, guys, bye. I hope this looks a little more apocalyptic for my Sims because, man, it was looking a little too nice.